So, willkommen zurück bei Fall of Tohulu. So. Und weiter geht's. Müssen wir den Penner suchen? Hopp, hopp, hopp. Vom Dach. You better keep your trap shut. I won't tell him anything. This town's deserted. Where is everybody? I reckon you might have scared him off with that ugly face of yours. <laughs> oh, da, 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 Rat mir alles. Okay. Will nicht. It won't open. Where is everybody? It's very quiet. Just leave me be, stranger. Leute. Schnaps, Schnaps, Schnaps. Kann ich eine Seitengasse rein? It won't budge. Hop. Noch weiter. Washington Street. Hop, hop, hop. Da ist er doch. It won't budge. Der kleine Trunkenbold. Hi. If you pardon my asking, have you lived here in this port all your life? Less than 37 years in old lady Warren's house. Before that over by the fishing canary. Cana canary. Old lady Warren's house? Go and fetch me a bottle of something to wet old sit up And I'll tell you all. Hab ich doch. Hab. Ja. Prost. Why, you're uncommonly kind, young fella. Here be a little something in gratitude that may help you in your search. Klappert. Das ist ein Schlüssel. Now you be calling me crazy. Like them that are rumoring an anchor in an lip switch. But old Zadok's seen all manner of wicked things since before you was born. <clears throat> old Captain Mobit where it all began. Telling desperate folks they'd order get better gods. Them's that that answer their prayers. Okay. Didn't the Christian folk of Innsmouth <coughs> object to such blasphemy? Aye, they did. It were around 46 that many folks in town were done with Obed and his ways. And all that wild preaching and too many missing, you see. Uh, a party of good folk followed Captain Obed's crowd out to the reef. Shots were fired. Next day, Obed and thirty of his fathers were in jail. And for weeks all were quiet. Till that artful night of forty-six. Them's out outside reckon out it being a riot. But I'd seen them. Swarms of them. Look, old man. I don't have time to listen to these fishing tales. 
was a massacre. The jail thrown open. Mounds of the dead and the dying. Soldiers screaming and shouting all across the town square. Come morning, the mess was cleaned up. Old Obed and his family takes charge, they did. Folks were told to keep shy as strangers if we were known what was good for us. Sadok, who did all this? Who did all this? Said the old captain was now deeper in debt to his even gods. They were hankering for more than just sacrificing. Obed told folks they had to take the oaths of Dago. What the hell are these oaths? You just asked old wastes about oaths of Dagon. I, he take the third oath. Just head over to his hole in the dark street. Then you'll see. For definite. He's given me a key to the town poorhouse. It could come in handy. So, that's what I was with you. So, so, so. Almond house. Ha ha! Dear knight! Boys, we must fight, but it the winds open. which are our yell shall never scare the mariner. Where did Captain Obit Marsh learn of these heathen matters? In war and foreign parts, the old fool I lent to ways of making gains, doing heathen things. He found a tribe of Kanuckies <laughs> in the South Seas led by a savage. The chief went by the name of Walakea. And his tribe never went without food. For they had all the fish they could catch. Old Obed learned from his Wallachia that these things on this earth as most folks never heard about. Seems these Kanuckies was worshipped in undersea gods with heaps of human sacrifices and other heathen things. But they was getting all kinds of favors in return. Plenty of fishing and even gold now and then. Human sacrifices? Maybe you've had just a bit too much. <clears throat> I don't blame you for not believing it, young fella. But just answer me this. Why did the Captain Obed roll out to the reef of Satan and chant a lot of rites and incantations in the dead of night so loud you could hear them all over the port? He cast something in the water that eve, out the other side of Devil's Reef. Some kind of thingamajig crafted out of lead. It was given to him by a Wallachia. So, what happened? Well, not long after the smoke started coming after the chimneys at the old gold refinery, the Marsh family and those that had joined with Obed in his ways has started a prospering in the esoteric order of Dagon. Came into being with his Ethan Sermon. Sermon. That shit they do. What kinds of ceremonies? Mm. Yeah. Get out of here, lad. Don't wait for nothing. They'll know now. Um. I think he's had his fill for the night. Oh. oh Gott, er schläft wirklich. So. It's just a trash can. Nothing of interest. So, also habe ich jetzt Schlüssel fürs Armenhaus. So, so, so. It's just an advertisement for the local Methodist church. Mr. Walters, I must speak yeah. with you. It's Jack. It's Jack. Super old man in Innsmouth who doesn't know my name. My name is Rebecca Lawrence, and unless you want to join Innsmouth's long list of missing, I'd urge you to follow me. Missing, huh? Like Burnham? Of that, I'm not sure. You'd be better off asking the Billingham's daughter, Ruth. She was dating Brian. What? Who's Ruth? Quickly, you have to follow me. It's not wise to be seen talking to outsiders. 
Okay, wohin folge ich dir jetzt? Jack, Innsmouth is a strange place. There are things that have no business being here. Foul, reeking things. Strange? Trust me, I'm good with strange. That remains to be seen, but I can help you. My father discovered this strange sign while studying an old manuscript. It seems to ward off the more unusual elements in Innsmouth. Whenever you find one, you can use it to find a moment of sanctuary. Now, I must leave before we're seen together. Okay. I've seen that eye-like symbol somewhere before, but never surrounded by a star. So, das speichern wir halt. So, und so. Rück. Also, so, hier ist die Kasse mit dem Penner. Also, wir wollen immer noch zum Armenhaus. Ja, ist ja auch ein Dächer. Halt auch nicht. Bewegt sich da oben irgendetwas? Natürlich nicht. I'm already fully pumped up. It won't open. So. It won't budge. Oh. Was ist das? Wo? Wir können auch reingucken. Mädel, bleib stehen. Ich will mit dir reden. Hi. Jack, we can't be seen talking together. What is it? Why do you stay in Innsmouth, Rebecca? My grandfather, John Lawrence, was editor of the Innsmouth Courier. He was murdered in the slaughter of 46. He had always despised the marshes and their blasphemous doings, and it was he who led the party out to the reef that night. They arrested Captain Marsh and his order and tossed them in the old jailhouse. A few weeks later, my grandfather was dead. My father saw him die. Him and many others burned alive in the courier's basement. All the more grounds to leave. To leave would be to fail my own legacy. I have a duty to protect the good in Innsmouth. At least what little good remains. Ah, oh, God. She knows plenty, but I need to have a look around myself if I'm gonna crack this case. Ich mache hier eine kleine Pause. 3, 2, 1. Tschüss und ciao.